Hi, it's Precious Lee, and I'm going to show you guys my nighttime routine. So come to bed with me. Typically, my skincare routine depends completely on the season. Like, it totally depends on if it's in the winter and my skin is drier, if it's in the summer or it's in the spring. Living in New York City and traveling all the time, it's really difficult sometimes to stick to one plan. So you gotta be ready to switch it up all the time. I can go from using three solid products to 10. And I intuitively do this by checking in with my skin, checking in with how I've been hydrating myself or not. Have I been traveling? Is my skin stressed and tired because I'm exhausted? All of those things are super important for me to know what it is I need to do to calm the skin down. My silk and satin is, I have, an, I have a silk um, pillowcase, which I think literally everybody needs. I've had one since I was little. Being a hairdresser's daughter, my father, we all had satin pillowcases for hair. And I um, learned out later on how good it is also for your skin. I have oily an oily t-zone in the warmer seasons and then i have normal to dry so basically it means this combination right now we're like in the winter fake winter in new york we don't know what it is right now it's snowing this for lunch and tomorrow it may be sunny so i am really dry right now i am going to be using a more hydrating um, system tonight First up, the one, the queen, Riri, look. This stuff, I remember seeing her video, going to bed with her, and this cleanser, taking off her makeup and cleansing her skin at once, I was like sold. I mean, I was already sold because it was Riri, but I'm going to use this, and it is called the Total Cleanser. This is so fire. I am known for having things spilled in my makeup bag. It's like the most annoying thing to have a product that you love, but have bad packaging. So, re, fire. Am I the only one that's kind of sad when you take your makeup off? You're like, whoa, did I get enough pictures? Like, did I document? Like, was, <sighs> it's gone now, so I say bye. Cleanser on the hands, put a little water on it. And say bye. Oh my gosh, I'm so sad when I do this sometimes. I'm like, oh my beautiful beef. Concentrating around the eyes. So I have on, I don't know, a couple of lashes. And you just get in there. Be gentle though. Okay, so I remember reading about Pharrell only using cold water on his skin. And so, I always try to remember that <laughs> when I'm taking my makeup off, I really, really like a warm cloth at first. And then after that, it's all cold water. After we cleanse, refresh, I really love toning. Now, there are a couple of toners I like. I love the Lancome toner, but tonight we're going to be using Ren Clean Skin Care. Ready, steady, glow. Daily tonic. This has a really nice scent that's not super strong. Um, and what I like about this toner is that it's hydrating. Sometimes when you're toning, you can totally strip the skin and you don't have to clarify with drying out. So, okay, toned. Now, the toning really prepares your skin for the next step. I love this mask, Instant Detox by Caudalie. I also love their mist spray too. I don't have any of that there now, but after you tone, it's, your skin is really ready for a good treatment. So you can use a mask like this, or you can go straight to some powerhouse skin nourishing serum and essence products. I love this new product that I've been trying for the past couple of months by You Beauty, and it is the Resurfacing Compound. I love that it has the retinol in there and it just feels really luxe for my skin without it being super um, heavy for the first step. It's like a gel consistency. 
and I like to press it in. Next up I'm going to use, we love the hyaluronic acid, is we've found out how yummy it is for our skin. Just do yourself a favor girl and get it. And boys too, like literally. Skin is super important for everybody and I think it's just really about finding out what works for you through trial and error. I also love this Nesco white jade roller. Jade is such a gentle, loving, healing stone. And when you put on those essence and serums, it's really important to try to get the product in the pores. So because you toned really well, it's already absorbing it more, but putting, um, using a jade roller is super therapeutic, but it also really gets the product in the skin. Look up the healing properties of jade and amethyst and rose quartz, whatever it is, because they're so popular now. But it would be really cool to, you know, switch up your roller depending on what vibe you're on um, for that crystal to charge you up as you charge your skin up. I was talking and I felt how, like, my lips, my big juicy lips are really, they can use some love in this stuff, seriously. It says it's a sleep mask. It's not, it's, it's a, whatever you want it mask. It's amazing. I love this stuff, Laneige. Laneige, Laneige, I don't know. Which, what are we calling it these days? But I call it fabulous. It's really amazing. And you know, as a girl, I've always had big lips and having those lips not hydrated is not fun. Now, I've tried a lot of different eye creams and there's so many different ones you can use. You can use brightening ones that have like that tint thing in it that brightens underneath. You can wear under your makeup or you can do, there's some with caffeine, but what I like the most at night is getting a thick, rich cream. So we're going to use the Lamia Eye Concentrate. We are going big while we're at home you put a little dollop now anybody that knows me knows that i will literally walk around with concealer in my bra ready because i love having my under eye taken care of it just really brightens up any look and you have to supplement that with a really great eye cream you always use your ring finger my mom always taught me use your ring finger my mom's skin literally looks like water is just gonna pop from it she has like stunning beautiful skin and i so anything she tells me about my skin i listen to her i'm like okay now sometimes not all the time it depends i like this from my mom too vitamin e you can buy vitamin e gel tab i think can you see that and this is like straight up vitamin e like pure if you've been in the sun a lot you had a lot of sun exposure like i love using this sometimes even under my eye in just certain spots and you literally can prick it i mean i do my little teeth and then you just squirt out the vitamin e so this is a really cool trick that I learned that my mom keeps her vitamin E in the cabinet and she uses it for certain spots if she has like a little hyperpigmentation or wherever you want to spot because we know vitamin E is really yummy for the skin. I like to let that like your serum and your essence to kind of like just like suck in and the moisturizer at night super super important. I mean, for me, what I really like is the thicker I can find, the better. I don't know what you guys are gonna think about this, but I've tried it and true for years. I love this stuff, skin food. You literally can get it from Whole Foods. It's so yummy, it's so major, skin food. I like it in the winter months. Ugh, my skin just feels so incredibly happy anyone that comes to my home knows that it you walk in and it's very we're giving temple vibes we it's smudged 
it's cleansed, it's high vibes, and I love to do that as a routine at night. I love to light candles, I love to meditate. It's really important for me to like have that beat at night before um, I go to sleep that I'm not looking at my phone and I'm not looking at an email or doing something um, on the screen. And I think it's super important we understand how much we're looking at screens. At night, I try to now put my phone a little further away from me. You know, a lot of people may think affirmations are silly or you know, you may feel uncomfortable at first trying it, but like I really do feel like your nighttime routine and just this part of your day could be a beautiful space you hold for yourself to affirm the things that you want to show up as and be as and release and, and heal and all of those different things that are going to center you back to yourself and to get you into the present moment so you can go to sleep and have that rejuvenation that sleep is actually for. I have a manifestation spray that I love. It's like different. I manifest a deeply beautiful, healing, loving, nourishing sleep. Night.